Sunday, 26th of March. I have fed my quail. I do feed them a southern states feed, but this chickweed right here, they just love fresh vegetables, I guess. They love fresh greens. Uh, I split it between these two cages, and there is rarely, if ever, anything much down there. That's all spilling that I did there. Those are little chips. They're actually doing pretty well on it, and these quail right here had kind of given up laying. I'm still probably going to put them in the pot by the summer as soon as these 54 come online. I don't know if you can tell, but that one right there has white on her face. And they're just they're just aging out. That one right there, aging out. Well, she may very well be laying a, an egg right now, but just like a dog's muzzle gets gray, the birds get white on their chins as they get older. And they also don't seem to come back as quickly from the molt. And these quail are second season quail. No, these are third season quail, and they're just entering their second. I'm getting about 18 eggs out of 28 birds probably 24 hens, so that's three quarters. That's not bad, but these are going to come online. They're starting to share, show their uh, red on their breast for the males, and so they're easier to sex, sex rather. That one who just went across, that's a male. Hopefully what I'll get is mostly hens but that's up to God right and there's this one right here that's the solid variety it's hard to sex them without pinching their bum but you know three feeders a little bit of chickweed and some water they're okay I'll be going in today and Hopefully finding the rest of these queens. I found the queen on that one, threw in a new queen there, split this, have to find her. She's in one of those. This one has a queen that needs to go. There's brood in the bottom, but not much. I've consolidated the boxes, and hopefully what I'll have is three or four splits. I'm sorry, three or four nukes over there by the end of July. Beautiful sunny day, Sunday day, so take care.